Hey guys, what's up? This time we're playing Volleyball in the Jungle. But oh, just gonna let you guys know. The last I played a game, but I kind of just threw it out because it was really bad, guys, and you guys wouldn't want to see it. But I f I forgot Smite, and my I kept my browser my League browser kept closing because I had this. Little announcement here asking me if I wanted to download something. I didn't click it, so every time I went in this, clicked in this region, it went ahead and closed league. So you guys wouldn't have wanted to see it anyways. But hopefully this one goes better. So let's go over the teams while we're waiting for it. We have a top Udia, ADC Silver. These guys are actually together, I believe, because they. She said that she was in the bathroom, so they're probably together. Then we have Jingle Viber. Midfield in support Lux. On the enemy team, they have a support Alista. Jungle Elise. Top Scion. Mid Diana. And Jinx as the ADC. So I'm just going to chill out here in my Russian swag gear. I just said that because my brother has a sweatshirt that's his Russian swag. He's really kind of the kind of guy who, like, he doesn't have any real Russian traditions or anything, but our family is a quarter Russian. And that's probably his favorite kind of quarter of our family, so he probably is just kind of like... He's probably just like this whole, like, idea of, like, he's kind of Russian that he was kind of like showing off, kind of like pride in being Russian. But... I guess I've probably, in my own way, done the same thing. Since in, I've taken, I start, uh, in school I take Italian and well, quarter Italian. Okay, I got that. It's so much better than the last time because I like got so low off of it. It was so horrible. It was so. You should not get me started on this. So I'm gonna go take out these guys because these were the ones that gave me trouble last time. They must perish. Okay, okay, I'm hoping, and I mean, I'm really hoping that I don't pop my passive. Because, last time when I popped my passive, it just made life a lot worse. So, if I can save that for something else, I am going to definitely save it for something else. Okay, so, at this point in time, I actually went for the wolves last time, and I kind of, I'm going to stick by that decision. Because it, it'll give me some more gold, and I'll level... Uh, well, I'm going to level up probably regardless of whether I do this or not at the red buff, but it's a little extra experience under the belt. But I'm not going to use smite on this one. Because that would just make red harder. And in this case, I actually go and I don't get Q force till I'm ready to gank. Which ganks were a bit weird because I had teleport <laughs> instead of <laughs> smite, so it was a bit, bit weird in my opinion. So let's see. Gonna just get all my health back off of that. I was actually able to, I think, get a ward by the time I got to my red buff. Because I kind of died. I didn't die. I mean, I, I beat the wolves, but I had to go back. I was just that low. I popped my passive. There was nothing I could actually do at that point except go back. And I actually went ahead and got a ward for my red buff. So I would know if anyone's going to try to invade me. Okay. So she just got kind of destroyed. So I wonder if we're going to have a bit of trouble this game. Though I can't say we had a, too much of an easier time last game. Let's see. He's pretty low. But I don't have my, um, what you know. Okay, so we should be able to get this just fine. Uh. Okay, I kind of forgot that part of his passive. Aw, uh, I, I, I killed him twice. By the way, I'm going to just say, like, this is something you're not supposed to do. So I'm not going to do it, but if you get the kill, you're not supposed to take any tax. Well, sometimes if you, like, go and jank, gank a lane... And you get the key, and you um, go ahead and you other one of the two who gets the kill. You kind of gotta be like a cool dude and kind of just let him get the farm. But if you if he gets the kill, it's okay to take a bit of farm. Just kind of like 
compensation for your time. Okay, and hopefully he doesn't die. Good. I'll hold top lane. Just let him know. Because, to be completely honest, we don't want too much damage on the turret. Chris, what are you doing? I don't know. I guess, yeah, I guess the silver is a Chris. Oh, speaking of which, uh, I didn't. Okay, I got him again, but <laughs> I don't want to screw with this guy. Just going to kind of throw him over my back. And I own this kill myself, so since this is probably going to be taken, I'm going to just take some of that tasty farm. I deserve it. I killed him. I forwarded our team's efforts. I'm just kidding. And ability power isn't necessary. Something you really got to build on volleyball is pretty much health because from you, this scales off your bonus health. So I'm going to get a rise into a war mogs. I'm going to become an insane amount of tank. And I might not be able to do much damage elsewise, but when I use this, my when I use my frenzy, if I get a lot of health, like right now I have 1,000... 300 I have 68 damage extra damage from that but I forget let's say 4k or because I've gotten games where I've had about four more than 4k health you know, I'm gonna go ahead and make sure this isn't warded little fear of mine I might have already walked past the ward okay so they might not see me from this position Okay, so let's see if I can't just come in from the behind. And I got that for Chris. Although, that means now I can take some farm. And let's see if we can't just get some damage on this turret. And if this guy stays for too long, just let him know that we could take his life without hesitating. So, if we can take this, okay, Lux might die if she's not careful. We got the turret down here. Let's see. I'm going to probably, uh, okay, for a second I thought my passive popped. But it didn't, and Scion ulted, so we have no idea where he's going, but it might just be, he might just be running the length of top lane. Because I think he already used his teleport. Uh, that sucks. Well, maybe I can bait her. Okay. So, I'm becoming incredibly strong for some reason. Like, I'm just like, oh, hey, dude, you, you left your car on my lawn. Blowed up. Uh, the power of... Health on volley is hilarious. I mean, like, I'm going to become a monster after this thing. <laughs> and I'm really, like, I'm psyched. I'm really psyched, guys, because whenever I become a monster, it's always a lot of fun. And they took Dragon without me. Of course, they took Dragon without their jungler as well. So I don't think there's too much of a difference. And... Of course, let's see, their jungler is the Elise, who I haven't seen yet. Seems like our team has seen them, but, uh, yep, he's dead. He has been death killed. And OP is here, actually. Um, Elise, 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 my bad. Because you just chatted, Lux, why would you stand right where they can hit you? gonna eat him I don't understand I have no idea what he's talking about I wasn't really paying too much attention to the fight so that's probably my bad
Okay, so Jinx is nearby. But I don't think we could actually like do much here. Unless we get like really powerfully greedy. Ugh, the greed guys. The greed it it commands my soul, guys. The greed. <laughs> I wanted that booty. Jinx's booty is a hot booty. That, that, I'll explain on that, right, guys? There was no greed in that. I wanted that. Okay, guys, let's move on. I just gave them, uh... Can't milk these. <laughs> but I can milk Jinx. Mm, no. Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm just kidding. And if you don't understand what that means, because you're too young. She has no... <laughs> Doesn't matter, guys. I will still do that. I will make the impossible come true with my volleyball jungle. Can't move. Come on! Come on, I want it! I want it so bad, guys. I want to kill Jinx. So I'm just wait here. Because they obviously have no clue unless they are baiting me. Sure. But I was playing... Speaking of which, I could probably go back and get this if I so choose, but I guess not. Cause I ran. I forgot about my I forgot about my own passive. If you guys don't know, when I reach 30% health, I end up getting that health back. So I'm just gonna back off. Say good job. She has no chest. Okay, so for now I should be just fine. He might be taking top turret, but let's see. How are we doing? I have all the kills. I should spread that out along to my team, but it seems like Jinx and Sion have the most kills on their team. So, like I've said before, you kind of can't take it. I'm the tank, so I don't need those kills. I'm just taking them because I'm greedy. Do your signals be careful. I guess he probably wants to farm. <laughs> I was going for the scion <laughs> not the farm uh yeah that wait I have 38 farm now she has 38 farm and I saw it. it's like a paradox I guess TP up in 10 sign is going AD so it seems like he's just that's kind of what sign's supposed to do I I think I'm pretty sure he's an AD champion. I don't care. I've been seen by something. Uh, but you know, I I didn't think I was gonna get her, but it was worth it because I got her flash, and I have my passive up in ten seconds, so I should be fine to do whatever I want. I can do whatever I want. Oh, not gonna say what that real lyrics are because they're a little um, not people friendly. Okay, so it seems like Scion is the only one on the team to teleport, so he's coming top. Jinx got another kill. So let's see. Me and Udyr. Um. Okay. Oh, wait. Okay, I have my health back, so I should be able to survive this pretty easily if I don't get caught out. Eh, you guys know. You guys should probably... Can you guys feel the pain I feel? Like, I could go for that, but there's a chance that I wouldn't get it. What? 
What? Ah, oh, I didn't cancel a move. I don't know, I kind of... We killed each other. I say that counts as a successful thing. No, it doesn't, guys, because he also killed Vilkaz. Meaning it was two for one. So, it's not really something you consider good. I should probably have waited till I could have gotten a better thing on her, and... Speaking of which, I still need to upgrade this. So, I should probably... Run... Run back and forth, because I can't get it yet, and I need it, because it will give me my chilling smite. And this will make so much more ease in my games, because I'll be able to smite my opponents. Okay, come on. I believe. Ah, dang it, don't die. So, yeah, we're already t facing a lot of turmoil in this whole situation. But, Cyan also died. So, I guess there's not too much of a problem, except she's going straight for the... Okay, that flash was worth it, because if I didn't get close enough, I probably wouldn't have been able to take her. And I'm a little bit afraid. They, they already got the dragon. I don't know when they got it exactly, but they got it sometime close. So I'll just say that. Udyo is on the way. Hopefully he doesn't want my blue buff. And he's taking my blue buff, of course. Because, I don't know, I guess he's behind or something. Like that. And I guess I'll just let him take it, because... We don't want an Udyo who's behind. Especially because Udyo is someone who can be so incredibly strong once he gets ahead. Just, it's a shame to let him fall behind so far. Come on. Get close. Uh, no, no, no. Okay, so I should be fine. Okay, well less fine considering that we have a Jinx here now. But let's see. We have three on three. The Jinx is stronger than us. Our um, Silver, so it could be a little bit troublesome unless we play this to a good extent. Okay. So she missed. That's good. Lux should probably stay back, but we could still make use of her ult. Okay, and I'm the only one capable of defending now. So, ah, oh, dang it, guys! It no, nah, and Lux takes the kill. Let's see, Lux is going three four. I wonder why she's taking the kills. It might simply be because she doesn't have too much faith in our um, ADC, considering our ADC has been having a bit of trouble with it, and that could be understandable because. But they both kind of got poked out of that, and that kind of like was a big problem for me. I'm going to say, back off, please back off, and be safe, and live. I'm coming as fast as I can, that smell I cannot cast, blah, 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 blah. It's because I don't have the three, uh, you shouldn't have gotten close, dude, you should just back off. That's one thing I don't like about some people, like, I can be the same way, if I want to, like, stay and maybe do something. I can kind of overstay my welcome, I guess. And I can guarantee that Lux got that off of the person she killed. I forget who she killed exactly. To be a little sad, I guess. That's not the best thing in the world for me to be forgetting. Because it has a lot to do with that team fight. But I think, yeah, she killed actually the Elise, I believe, actually. Okay. So she's pretty low, and I guess that's probably why she kind of just gave up, but let's see. I'm hoping that I can come in stealthily. And I didn't come in too stealthily. So I should probably back off and 
see what I can do. Okay, so there's a pretty good chance that they'll be able to make some good plays here. As long as the uh, Vilkaz doesn't die. Okay, that doesn't matter too much that I had to take it. But we should be pretty careful. Ah, uh, this guy, this Elise is probably going full on damage. Ah! Dang! Dang it, guys, I messed that up, and I know it was a bad team fight from the beginning, but I almost got it if I, I kind of misclicked and clicked in front of her instead of on her and so I didn't auto attack her one more time so that screwed us over a bit let's see I want pretty much a good health item but I also want an arm item because she's getting so strong usually you can just like do a whole lot with just health but at this point I really have to get some other kind of fences especially against Jinx and Scion who are the strongest on the team and She's actually coming back because of all the help she's been getting, and Vilkaz is a very immobile champ, so he's easily kind of ganked, and he also just got killed, the Udi, I mean, just got killed by the Diana, so she's definitely making a sort of comeback. It wasn't as bad, because it was just, it was just the... One kill above an amount of death rate, but now, now it's getting a little out of hand, guys. Let's see if I can't just get some farm. Do you remember this move? Do you remember this move? Uh huh. He wants me to get off his farm, or they want me to go mid. Or dragon, I don't know. Speak English. Huh. I'm a pretty good tank at the moment, but. Sometimes the overwhelming overwhelming damage brings pure tankiness, and I have to say that they do have some overwhelming. Ah, oh, dang it! I flashed right into that. Okay, so got hit by that. Got my passive, so I should heal off quite nicely. And if we can turn this around, which we can if I get a very good engage, and now our team is dead. I have to block that for her. Ah, oh, dang it. That's... Live, I... Live! Live! I died for... Come on, like, I sacrificed myself for you. That's like, never mind. Never mind, we're gonna lose if we don't do something more team-like. I'm, Udia, we can win. We need to get picks. Okay. We gotta like keep our heads calm. We can't get angry at our team. We can't get angry at all. But it seems like he's lagging. So hopefully, you know, we can kind of make something happen here or there. Miracle plays, guys. Never give up on the miracles. But we need to stop this shy on in the top lane. So hopefully, we can do something. Hopefully, he's cocky enough. Like, oh, I've got a lot of kills. Whatever you throw at me, I can go ahead and I can get them. Just gonna slow him down. Don't fight him! He's undead. Sometimes you gotta tell them. Okay, that wasn't the smartest thing to do, but I'm in no place to judge. I am not winning this game for us. I got too many kills. So, I have no right to speak, to be completely honest. I should have been more focused on getting my teammates the kills, but I kind of was just getting them for myself. And that's something I did pretty bad.
Crest of Cinders. So I'm gonna go get the new Cinder Hulk item, I guess. Just because it will help me with my overall tankiness. Hopefully they don't peel off it and just go for me. Hopefully I seem inconsequential enough. But they already... Okay. Uh... Hopefully I can just get out of this alive. Thank you, minions. You saved my life. Okay, and hopefully, yep, we got this. Okay, good. I let my enemy team get that, and why I am attack trying to attack the. Ah, uh, ah! Uh, I'm gonna go get my jungle item. Since I can't get this, I probably should go ahead and get my get towards my Cinder Hulk. Because it will give me that AoE damage that I so uh, eagerly crave. Okay. I don't know why he's trying to fight him. I believe he ran all over him in lane. He may be going for that bait. But he should still be very careful. And I kind of had to throw him in the turret range so he would die faster. But that's all on a daily basis in my life now. Let me 1v1 Udyr. No! <laughs> you, you're gonna wreck him. That would be dumb. I agree. So let's see. Lee's has gone to an extent of damage. Just gonna go ahead and farm. Just hoping I could get her back off a bit. Cause she, they're pushing so I might as well counter push. A bit, get the, get the minions pushing towards their side. And that caused a bit of a build up. Okay, now there's three of them in the mid lane. One of them is fed beyond belief. The other one is sort of feeding, I guess. She's died quite a bit, but she has been very influential in this game, and I'm not gonna say say that she hasn't. This champion is continuously damaging nearby enemies. Okay, so the good it's pretty good that she was able to dodge that. Ah, uh, dang it. So that was a failure on my side, guys. So, I'm going to say that that was pretty failure-esque. Okay. Just going to do that. You see what I did there? Hopefully you guys did. Okay, I'm going to let my teammates get that. Let my teammates get that. And I have to go back to the top lane pretty quickly. I actually like what they do with the Cinder Hulk thing. I don't know much about it. It gives you this buff. It. Uh, I'm not going to try to explain it because I know very little about it. And trying to explain it on my part would just be probably teaching you it wrong. And I hope not to do that. Okay. Come on, survive. Okay, that's good. But you gotta get away. You gotta get. You gotta. Oh, uh, that's that's fine. But I mean, like, if he can one v one you while he's dead, you probably should try your best to get away. I need fun. Cause. That's what he said before. But the thing is, what he really needs to do is to. Th I'm not gonna say criticism. He needs to build some some armor. And he's making a lot of perhaps moves that he shouldn't be making, which is a little sad because Udyr is a really strong champion, and I guess he almost may uh, overestimate that strength. And I mean, it's not totally his fault. Scion is also a very strong lane opponent. Ah, uh, if I had my flash, guys. Okay, I'm not gonna get that. I'm gonna let the Udyr get that. Because, like I said before, I need to be less greedy and help my team. And now we have to go help the Sivir. 
and hopefully he keeps chasing but it seems like he turned off so I'd say we should back off and try to ambush their team so I'm gonna try to take this for my team and then get that okay guys I promise you guys I did not try to get that it just happened that way now we should just back off or not I don't know maybe we could take him but I'm gonna say I'm gonna try to stay here and fight this guy just because <laughs> I have my passive and I was afraid he was gonna go for luck so kill someone else on our team so I guess perhaps I was wouldn't be the best target for his aggression because I'm tanky enough to take it and I'm going health and armor which of course does help on that so let's go some health and magic because just maybe get a uh, for now I'm just gonna go health some more pure health I guess see what will be great to get Banshee's Veil should be a good item so they got a turret and we need to focus on getting other turrets. In my other game, we won. At this about time. You could say it did pretty well, but that's because my team kind of carried me. And I can't. I'm not the like ideal champion to carry with, though I do a lot of damage. I'm just wondering, how do I activate the Cinder Hulk item? Okay, it's activated now. But what's it do? Dealing magic wraps up over time. But I'm kind of curious that, like, okay, it's auto attack base. Okay, good. But I had this, like, like sunfire cape, like, or uh, that thing that's over here, right? That's what got me confused. So it's similar to my, um, whatever, my W. Except it has a lot, it has a lot more of a kind of buff up. And it buffs up, and it kind of lasts a bit longer. Like, this thing is going down pretty fast, while this one goes up a bit more okay so I sacrificed my life for the I'm gonna say get out of there I'm gonna say oh yeah Cyan is ulting okay that was a good like almost power on the locks Luxes cuz Lux is gonna die but she's helped save the Whoever she helped save the Velkaz, she sacrificed her life. She got helped us get the kill. Cause if you went straight, like by yourself, Lux may not be able to defeat us. So I'm just gonna say that's a good job, and that's something you gotta pay attention to. Who should take what? If it's a choice between two people dying, and, and let's say this, you have to like kind of like see which ones like you can like live without. Like I'm not saying this in a mean way, but like let's say between Lux and Velkaz, if Velkaz died first. Lux, I don't think she has, she's been dealing some damage, but she's not full damage. She does have some good support items, so it might actually, like, have made her, uh, how it easier to kill without getting the guy on my channel. Like, look at this. She has zero. Okay, 302 AP. That makes more sense, because I'm like, zero. She has a needlessly large rod. That rod is big, and it gives you a lot of magic resist, guys. Magic damage. Guys, don't don't mind me. I don't know what I'm talking about. Continue going and watching the your previous season. But here, like before, I didn't realize this, but the, if they're on like the big buffs on, like they can't die from like ticking damage. Oh wait, <laughs> I didn't. Realize they had Baron buff. I'm gonna just back out. See, my team should be able to get that kill. And I didn't want to die. And now that I am not taking damage, I'm actually getting more health back. Which is good for me. So you see, guys, everything I kind of want to do is has to be, like, strategically planned in some sort of way. Okay, so I got stunned there, but hopefully we can get this, and I think Udyr should be able to 
get the other person, or Shiver, I guess, went after her. Ooh, your dad, I forgot, sorry, guys. Well, I mean, I don't know why I'm apologizing. I just kind of made a mistake on names. But, it seems to be the Chris that has saved us. And, let's see if we can't get some pushing down. They push a bit more than back. I'm gonna stop this push in the whatever. Because apparently, Cyan is teleporting. So it's a good thing I went back. And he's already strong enough. Okay, so apparently he is so strong, there's nothing I can do to stop him. But, I have my other teammates who are very strong and can help me stop him. And, you gotta have to like interrupt him in that, because he continues to lose his health and he gains a lot of health back from auto-attacking. So if you can prevent him from like getting off those auto attacks with your flip, or just like hiding him, he's gonna die much faster than if you did. If you didn't do that, so I can get a f more health and look at this, guys. <sighs> Wrong one, <laughs> but 450. Like it already does about 200 damage, and by its own. But now it does 479 damage. <laughs> so that's actually like pretty good, guys. It's a pretty good like thing, like. Volleyball, if I can time it right, let's say go W and then into the D. Like, W into like the D, like that's where my whatever is, my smite. I will do, like, I'll be able to like almost like smite Baron for a bit more than just 950. So let me just back off, let my health regen. Hopefully my team can come in and do something. And there's the super strong. Gonna, oh, I actually got him. Not my attention, guys, but let's say, anyways. Okay, I was going to stay back there because I didn't think we were gonna, I was gonna survive anyways because um, Alistair and whoever was coming after us they had people okay good good job now run run no Diana Diana no guys you kind of gotta save this save our inhibitor or stop the pushing minions no 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 don't die don't die Lux you have a shield and you missed it <laughs> it's fine Ah, except that he just died. That is something we don't want, because we don't have anyone, like, to help defend. I'll be up soon, but that's not the problem. I don't have boots, actually. I just realized that. Maybe if I had boots, I'd be doing better. A little bit better. Because I'm kind of, like, dying. Oh, by the way, guys, something I want to mention real quick, because this is going to be up a little bit later than... I had planned, because like I said, this is my second recording, just like, heads up in case you guys didn't notice that. I was planning on saying that first, but I forgot that. Misfortuner. So maybe we should stop this guy from pushing, because he'll destroy our guy, think, in a sec. Okay, we got him now. Let's say we got a flip. Okay, good, we saved our inhibitor. See, that like takes off a bunch of the damage. I wanna help him, I really do, but he's so far away. But if you guys see, like, udio has been getting kills and he's becoming incredibly strong. Okay, maybe we could do something here. And I missed, but we should still get her. That's good. Okay, so let's see. Gonna go ahead and do what I must. Just let my team get that. Allow my tankiness to tank it. Oh, guys. See, that's something like we had a big shot at like losing this, I guess you could say. But, thanks to this, 
Uh, I wanted to save his life, but I couldn't. I couldn't save Alex's life. But, oh, look at this. I'm getting my health back. But just look at that health regen. Let me look at it now. It's to 30% of my maximum. So it's, this is like, I don't know. It seems like I gain more than I'm supposed to, but I think that's because I have the war mugs. Yep. My health actually regens really fast because of the war mugs. And this just gets more powerful as I get more health. So let's see, what else can I get that gives me a lot of health? Uh, this. Let's see, which one gives me the most health? This, like, I don't really scale too much off of auto attacks, I guess. Getting that bit more auto attack damage, but it doesn't hurt. Considering... So, I guess I'll get it anyways, because now, 563, and that's only the 380, and that's like almost only, that's only half of the uh, health I'm getting from the full item. So, I'm just saying that this guy is, is why you should build health on Volleybear. Okay, so right now, I guess Cyan ran away. But let's go for the Baron. Don't. Come on. Like, this is going to help me, like, take down the Baron much faster because I have it. So let's see. Just, like, let's pay attention. Well, okay, I didn't smite it, but I don't think I need to. They all kind of just peeled off. And this gives us much, much more power. So we can go ahead and push now fairly easily and this will give our minions a lot of power Udio has teleport so that's why he backed but I don't know why he teleported off a super minion because that just made it slower into getting to the base let's see hand of baron I don't know what it does exactly to super minions but it has each of them has a going effect uh, I died so let's see if we can't just get this done. End the game, guys. It's only Diana. Okay, no, never mind. It's also Ollie Star. And she had to flash out. So, <laughs> Baron is gone. Except on the Velikars, but that was kind of a waste of Baron. But, well, it wasn't a waste because we got a lot off of it. And I'm going to just say, like, back. Save the Baron buff push power. <coughs> Sorry, just gotta add my R. So, they have almost every dra dragon, and it's probably up, so if they do get the next dragon, that could be a little bad for us, I guess. Huh, I just realized I still don't have my boots. I have just so much health. You guys wanna just say perhaps just forget the boots for now? I would say I probably shouldn't, but wait, what's this do? Unique passive. This is 800 health. I'm gonna go for another War Mugs. So I'm not gonna get the same passive, but I mean, just the stacking of health gives me a lot of more damage than I would get from the other thing. As long as I get my frenzy pretty off, pr off pretty well. As you guys see, I'm actually pretty slow, but that is kind of like change when I use my. Rolling Thunder. Ah, that's right now 260. Oh, that's. Mm, let me think, guys. 900 damage, guys. So, that may seem a little inconsequential to you, but it is going to take everything to a higher level. And they actually got the last dragon, I believe. Yep. And she does 1000 damage on this might. So, that was a bad team fight for us, I guess. Udyo is top lane. We probably should have been more together as a team. And I'm going to just sell this because I'm going to get some magic damage. Like, pure magic damage because that's probably actually going to give me some good power if we survive this. And if I kind of, like, build it into 
uh, Luden's Echo. Because that will give me some splash damage. Come on, team. Survive. Let us survive. Uh, please, 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 no. This might be the end. This might be the end if we're not careful. Come on, somebody. Uh, yeah, this might just be the end, guys. GG. Well played. Too bad, though. It was a really fun game. Win or lose. I think we did a good job. And our team almost got the comeback, guys. But we were just a little bit too greedy. So I wanted to say, guys, this is something you can, like, think about. We looked like we were pretty bad in the beginning, like we were going to lose. I almost thought we might lose if we didn't pull ourselves together at 20 minutes. I was a little down, uh, d looking down back then, guys, but we did it. We made the almost comeback. So, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. If so, like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time on the League of Legends.